Amen. You may be seated. What a blessing to be able to come as we are this morning, no matter what that looks like or feels like. Good morning, everyone. I'm Crystal Pruitt. I'm the Children's Ministry Program Leader, and it is time for Christ Kids time. If you're a Christ kid or a Christ kid at heart, can you give me a big wave? Yes. This morning, Pastor Morris is talking with us about how we can keep a rhythm. Oh, wait, you said it wasn't that kind of rhythm, right? No, no, not that kind of rhythm. Okay, sorry, sorry. To help us understand, let's do a little activity together. Take a look at your clothes that you have on this morning, and I want you to choose one color that you're wearing, just one, okay? Blue, black, white, green, or pink. Look for one of those or something that's kind of close. Okay. If you're wearing blue, your word is going to be pray. So when I say blue, you'll say pray. Yes. If you're wearing white, your word is going to be exercise. So white, you're getting the hang of it. Yes. <laughs> if you're wearing green, your word is going to be rest. So green is yes. If you're wearing pink, your word is going to be work. So pink, work. All right. Let's try it a little bit faster. You ready? You can do it. All right. Pink. White. Blue. Pray. Green. Black. You didn't say black. Didn't say oh, I didn't say black. <laughs> eat. Black is eat. Blue. Pray. White. Pink. Green. Black. Eat. Pink. White, blue, pray, green. Oh, that's stressful because you didn't know what was coming next. You didn't know when to expect your color. We didn't have a rhythm. Let's try it in a rhythm or a pattern. Blue, black, white, green, pink. Blue, white, blue, black, white, green, pink. Ready? I've got to get the rhythm. Blue, pray, black, white, green, pink. Blue, pray. black, Eat. white, green, pink. One more time. Blue, pray. black, Eat. white, green, pink. Much better. You see, God made our brains to look for and expect patterns. Our bodies operate on rhythms and cycles like daytime and nighttime, awake time and sleep time. But part of the rhythm in our lives should also include time for God. It's time we spend talking with God, growing closer to the one who made us. Our time with God can help our souls to rest and refresh. It helps our get day get started on the right foot or settle us down for that nighttime sleep. So when you have a rhythm, then your body is more in sync. Let's spend time talking with God in prayer now. Hey, God, thank you for the amazing ways that you made our bodies for rhythms, whether we're dancing to the rhythm to praise you or we're seeking you as part of our daily rhythm, you're always with us. Forgive us when we make other things more important than you. Help us to find peace and calmness when we make the choice to make you part of our rhythm. We love you so much, God. Amen. <laughs> 